Hey, this is Diana and Janet with Two Moms Review, and today we are gonna do a review of the Carlin by Mihoko. Two Moms Review, here we go. Like, I don't like to spend a lot of time on my hair, and I found this and I fell in love with it. In fact, I first bought one, then I had to order two more because my daughter loved it so much that she used it. It comes in a few basic colors, and they have wires in these, so they bend and they hold their shape. The whole purpose of this is to put in a hairstyle and let it and have it stay in. And so this is my solution. I totally love it, but we're gonna demonstrate to you with our girls different hairstyles and show you how it works. Um, but before we do that, let's introduce our girls. Girls, come on in. These are our daughters. This is my daughter. And as you can see, she has got very long, very thick and heavy hair. Janet's daughter has um, short and a little bit thinner hair. It's not as heavy. But the nice thing is, is this works universally on long and thick hair and short hair. So for our first demonstration, I'm actually gonna do it on Janet's daughter. Um, just brush it out first and then smooth it out um, as you are going back into a ponytail. And then you just wanna put all of the hair through the hole and then just kind of squeeze the hole tight. It's metal, it's a wire inside there and so it does keep its form. And then you pull it down almost all the way down and then you wrap it up. Just roll. Okay, once you get it um, to the scalp, I like to make sure it's nice and tight to the scalp. Then you just wrap each end, tuck one behind the other and that's it. The nicest thing about it is if Alexa sleeps on this tonight, in the morning when she takes this out, it will be nice beachy waves. And so that turns out really cute too. So when I'm in a hurry, when I put this in, I don't go all the way to the very bottom, okay? And you don't have to. As long as you've got all of the hair and you're mostly to the bottom, then that's gonna work just fine. See how, I mean, you can do it pretty quickly, but if I really want the curls to be nice in the morning, I recommend going as close to the bottom as you can and then tucking in the very bottom hairs um, so that they curl in the same direction. Otherwise, you're gonna have a kink up the opposite way. So if I wanted her to have beach waves the next day, I would probably spritz this with water, maybe a little bit of gel or something um, to hold it. And then I would take this all the way down to just about the very edge and then what I would do is I would tuck the um, hairs that are left, the stranded hairs here, under, and that will make the bottoms of the curl go the same direction as the rest of the curl. So if you have little wispies that are sticking out like we did here, I just, as soon as I notice them, I just grab them and work them in with the rest of the curls. So she had some wispies here. Then I just grab them as soon as they can reach it and I keep tucking them in. And then again, just grab it like that. And she has slept in this and the next day she has great curls. They, they kind of start lower in the scalp. Yes, but I can show you some, a technique if you have two that helps keep the curls even a little bit higher and it turns Ooh. out really cute as well. I've slept in it, it's kind of soft. It didn't bother me yeah, sleeping I in did it too. at all. Mm -hmm. And I love to work out in mine because I don't work out like hardcore running, but I'm doing jogging and walking and stuff and sweating and it just gets all my hair off of my neck. And oh. in the summer and things, that's... Well, and the nice thing is if you like to work out, but then you have to go to work right after, you can work out in this, and then if you if you like spritz it or sleep in it, and then you can work out in it, and then you can take it out and have nice beachy waves for work.
that's like a good for ballet or dance or something like that or some church. at all if you take it the carlin out when it's still wet the curls won't stay but so you just spritz it a little bit get it a little bit damp and then you put the carlin in and then the next morning the curls stay much longer throughout the day and then another tip which you taught me is make i think you, we showed it but just want to emphasize it's so important if there's ends that don't like if your hair is layered and there's pieces that fall out of the carlin just wind them back on because otherwise they'll be straight and the rest will be curly. The third tip is to make sure if you want curls that don't start at the bottom of your hair to put it up as high as you can mm -hmm. on your head. So I think that it's really cute when you do two on each side. So like a layup bun up here and then it gets curly like all the way down. Mm -hmm. It takes a little bit of experimentation to get the curls just right. You don't want to over wrap too tight in the ends. Otherwise you get these super tight curls at the bottom and then bigger curls on top. So just experiment with it. I love this product. It saved me a lot of time and I think it's really fun. If you want to buy a Carlin, we will put the link in the video description. It's not easy to find. And also we have an exclusive coupon to get 15% off. Woohoo! Yay! So thanks for watching our video on the review of the Carlin. We really like it um, a lot. I think it is a must have. Any hair that you want to put up or curl. Yeah, yeah. It's really convenient. I love it. So um, if you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any other videos just like this one. Thanks for watching. What Carlin? The carbon dioxide? No, oh, Carlin. Carlin dioxide, that's funny. <laughs>